Hello everyone and welcome to Philip Miller Furniture. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Cobalt Tool Chest and Cabinet. Okay, here I'm opening up the box. I pull out a lot of the different materials. I'm packing everything and that was quite a fun. Uh, there's also something here in the drawer. Make sure you check the drawer. Uh, there's a box full of all the wheels um, and screws that you need to attach everything. There's the big picture of everything. And here's the top. Uh, just want to make sure you saw that. So here what I'm doing is I'm attaching the wheels. This is pretty easy to do. The, my favorite part was my son came out here to help me and he wanted to uh, put some on so I let him do it. They were simple enough. Even your four-year-old can do it. And this is just proof of that. Um, he really loved helping dad out. So here I'm using an Allen wrench to tighten everything. They give you this Allen wrench in the packet, so that's really nice. Make sure they're nice and tight when you uh, turn everything. My son's putting in the last one, and uh, we're good. So here I'm putting the top on, and you can see here's a hole, and this has a little clip that attaches to this little metal piece. I Right here I noticed that it was bent. I um, took a flathead and just bent it out. Um, you know, these are made from China. Um, that's one bad thing about this that I have to say that I really didn't like having to do, but it was a pretty easy fix. This just fits right underneath, and then you just insert the screw. Um, it's a Phillips head, so you just screw it in, and you do it all the way around. You'll see here that there are actually four screws. Uh, that was the first one, and I'm doing the second one right now. And then here's the third, and then here's the last one. That's it. I'm done. Turning around here, you can see the front. Here are the drawers. They came out pretty good. I They felt sturdy to me. A lot of people said that they weren't. Um, they lock in, so you got to make sure your top tray is locked in before you pull out the second one. Um, but they all opened well for me. I didn't have any issues with this. Uh, as some of the people have reported on some of the reviews that I saw online, but I thought it was good. They seemed really sturdy to me and they gave you a key to lock everything. I like the two USB ports on the back, that's really nice. You could charge your phone out there or put some other thing in there. There's the power cord that comes out the back that you can actually attach, and this is kind of the top. I like this because it has like a cup holder and some other things that you can store some things in. This is the top tool chest I'm taking out of the box right now. It felt pretty sturdy to me. Um, again, it came with its own key. I really like the hydraulic system here. That was really nice. It came up really well. I felt it, it was solid and well made. They have another uh, outlet here to where you can hook a cord in. Here's the back of it. Overall, I really liked this storage system. The only issue was the little denting on the back, but that was easily to fix. I like these little tray holders where you could put little things like cups or little screws. Um, overall, it was a good system. I would highly recommend it to anyone. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe to my channel. Give me some likes and comments. I'll be happy to respond.